Lithium-ion batteries have some problems. They lose efficiency when the weather is too hot or cold. They lose the ability to fully charge over time. They can catch fire. There are many new players in Battery Town seeking to take market share from lithium. One company that has been working on the problem for a decade now is Ambry, which has been largely funded by Bill Gates. I learned about Ambry because it was the counterparty to the antimony supply agreement with Perpetua Resources that I wrote about in August. That led to a chat with Ambry Executive Chairman Dan Leff and Chief Commercial Officer Adam Briggs. Ambry is a 10-year-old company that spun out of research from Professor Donald Sadaway's laboratory at MIT, Leff told me as we kicked off our discussion. And it was the master's and PhD thesis work of David Bradwell. Briggs, who has extensive management and commercial experience in the battery storage arena, also joined Ambry around the same time. We assessed that we needed to do three things in order to bring the company effectively from the lab to the market at scale, Leff said. Number one was to retire technology risk. Number two was to build a commercial pipeline of opportunities by asking the market, if we built this product at this price and performance point, would you buy at scale? The Ambry team was able to tick off the first two boxes and then went to work on addressing the third key go, raising adequa. Leff said the building of a strong syndicate of investors is critical. While the company has largely been funded over the most recent several years by Bill Gates, that's not their team's investment model, he told me.